We know giving matters, and it's not only a mantra here for us at WC9, it's an effort that we're striving to accomplish by helping to make an impact right here in our own backyard. Yes, and so this morning we are in Silver Spring collecting non-perishable food items for families dealing with food insecurity. Allison Seymour live at the Giant on Cherry Hill Road looking fabulous, and behind you it looks like it's a party. <laughs> It is a party. It's about to get started here. Um, I mean, you know what? It just feels good actually to give, right? And to have an opportunity to do so. And that's why we're out here today. We're helping you help all of us uh, through Kingdom Cares. And we profiled Kingdom Cares actually on Get Uplifted. They are such a wonderful outreach from uh, the AME Church, Kingdom Fellowship AME Church. And they do lots of good work. And especially think about the kids who during the summer months, might not get the food that they would get normally in school, right? So they are stepping in and filling that gap, and we are asking that you come out and help by donating non-perishable food items. And for a little bit more on exactly what Kingdom Cares is all about, my uh, colleague, Leslie Foster, did a little profile piece on exactly the good work that they do. Check it out. Our intention is to help end hunger in Maryland. Reverend Kendra Smith is one of the leaders at Kingdom Fellowship AME Church in Silver Spring, Maryland. They started Kingdom Care's food distribution program during the pandemic, and today it's still going strong, serving Montgomery and Prince George's County residents. We like to eat every day, and we want to make sure that our families can eat every day nutritious meals that will really help them to stay healthy and help them to stay strong and especially their children. In the last three years, Kingdom Cares has served more than 180,000 households, distributed more than 4.9 million pounds of food and touched the lives of more than 380,000 individuals. We intentionally serve in the areas that are harder to reach and that have the greatest need for food security. As many people don't realize that what happens when a person is food insecure is that the first thing they're gonna cut is they're gonna cut their food budget so that they can make sure that the other items for their household that they need, they will be able to meet. Every week, volunteers like Montrese Williams help sort, pack, and serve more than 1,500 households. What I find most rewarding about volunteering with Kingdom Cares is just the overall experiences. You come into contact with all walks of life. Um, you're interacting with volunteers that are attempting to achieve a common goal. You simply want to give back. But most importantly, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. Um, and you just, you never know the way that you're going to bless others' lives. Leslie, thank you so much for that. So all of what's donated today stays right here and it helps families locally. When you come in, we're gonna give you a card. Let me show it to you. It's gonna have everything that Kingdom Cares needs. Today, we're making it really simple for you, and we are out here until 6.30 tonight, trying to do some good as we kick off our Summer Giving Matters campaign. Okay, so I know you here at WPGC, they're already starting. Come out, even if you just wanna get the good vibes going on this Friday. Back to you, uh, Mary Marshall with the Weather Watch Alert.